Good afternoon and welcome to Collection Speed Dating at Fort Ticonderoga. I am Matthew Cagle, the curator, and I have a particularly interesting archaeological artifact here right now. Although Fort Ticonderoga is a military position, there were significant numbers of women and children that were here throughout the 18th century. And this, amongst all the objects in our archaeological collection, may be the only one that we can specifically attribute to a woman. This is actually the bottom of a patent, which is a type of overshoe, where this iron ring would have sat resting against the ground, mounted to a wooden sole that a woman would have slipped her shoe into, strapped herself in, lifting her off the ground in the muck and the filth to keep her shoes clean and out of the dirt. These are only worn by women in the 18th century, and thus this object becomes possibly the only piece in our archaeological collection that identifies it as having belonged to a woman. The most famous incident in Fort Ticonderoga's history, May 10th of 1775, the capture of the fort by Benedict Arnold and Ethan Allen, saw nearly a third of the individuals here, when it was still in British control, that were captured that May, that were actually women and children. 